Keto Fit is back with a brand new flavor. Long time ago, when they first came out, we reviewed the Keto Fit. They were, they called them chocolate, but they were like chocolate chip bars. They were delicious. We really liked them. The owner reached out to us and said, hey, can I send you the brand new flavor? Yes, please. And it's salted caramel. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things, like recipe videos, and we do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on a couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms, like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is TwoCrazyKetos.com, and that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. We got a bar to review. Keto Fit Bars. It sounds like a bar like you would drink at, but this says, is, this is a, a bar that you eat. Yes, it says right on the back, try them blended with coffee. I don't want to waste them, to be <laughs> honest, right? So... I mean, you can do that, but I yeah, like that's eating true. them. Um, I don't know, about a year and a half ago, we reviewed the Keto Fit Bar. It may have been closer to two years ago. I'm not even is. quite sure. Uh, we really like them. They have a new flavor. I know this has been a long time coming. These are uh, salted caramel made with MC2 oil and collagen. And uh, we're going to try these right now. Here we go. I like the yellow packaging. I know. Well, it's that's kind of cool. That's Keto Fit. Yeah. They're yellow. I don't have my glasses, so you're going to have to read everything. I can help. But. First is the taste test. Which is the best part, right? And right now we are camping. Ooh. This is a good camping food option. Yeah, we are camping at John Pennecamp Coral Reef State Park in, in the, Keys. the Keys. It's in Key Largo, Florida. We've had these in the refrigerator because it's like butt hot outside. And they're they can get globby if I remember correctly. Because yeah. they're very fatty. Yeah. So there you go. Thank you. And um, yes, yeah, so we figured this is good because this is a good camping food. It's a good thing to keep in the refrigerator. You want a little bit of a pick-me-up. Uh, very fatty. You can see all the Smells butter. Smells delicious. You can see all the, the, the fatty goodness in there. You ready? Can you dink it? Dink. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Got a good salt of caramel flavor. It tastes, honestly, very similar to the other flavor. Yeah. Is that what you find? I mean, it doesn't have chocolate chips in it. No chocolate chips. It's good, though. It's been a while since we've had the chocolate one, or the chocolate chip one. Mm-hmm. But similar texture, similar taste. It's almost like this is the base, and then they add chocolate chips to the other one. But this yeah. is the new flavor, so mm -hmm. they've just gone backwards. <laughs> um, what do you think? It's got a, it's got a good caramel flavor. I don't know about salted caramel. Oh, Are no, you getting salt salted? No, it's not salted. I'm getting caramel flavor, mm -hmm. but it's good. Really good. Five things. Five things. Five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're going to talk about the ingredients. Does it keto based on nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? I actually think I can read oh, the yeah, back. Oh yeah, because the back. Because they have it. it on the back too. Thanks guys. Okay, so. The ingredients, organic almond butter, mm. chicory root fiber, grass-fed uh, bovine collagen, organic cacao butter, Ow. MCT oil powder, which is MCT oil from coconut and acacia gum, sunflower lecithin, coconut oil, Himalayan pink salt, natural flavors, and stevia. Okay. So uh, ingredients are really good. Chicory root fiber, that's one that some people don't have any problems with it. Other people do. The best thing to do is test yourself. Yeah. Test your glucose and look and see what kind of a reaction you have. I personally don't worry about a one or two point thing, but if you have a 30, 40, 50 point jump, that's a different thing. But everybody is different yeah, when it comes to chicory root fiber. Unless you check it yourself. Yep. So number two, does it keto based on a nutrition label? Okay, so a bar is 300 calories. That is fatty. 24 grams of fat, 13 grams of protein, 13 total carbohydrates, nine dietary fiber, and so uh, four net carbs. Okay, that's yeah. good. 
Um, just get 13 total carbs isn't like terrible. I'm like really good with 13 total carbs. Yeah. Yeah. Especially for something that's a, like a sweet bar like this. You know, nine grams of dietary fiber, you know, that's right on the edge for me. But 13 total carbs, the best thing to do, do what we do. Follow either a total carb protocol and you don't have to do it at 20. You could do it at 30. Yeah. Or do a net carb protocol where here you have four net carbs, but put a total carb cap. Right. Like say, I'm going to do no more than 20 net carbs, but no more than 30 total carbs. Then Got plenty of room for that. That's going to let you fit one of these in, but you're probably not going to fit two or definitely won't fit three because that would put you at 39 total carbs. But I could definitely eat three because number three... How do they taste? These are really good. They're really, really tasty. And they've got that, like, the globby butter all through it. If it mm -hmm. is not right out of the refrigerator and you're eating it, you know, at room temperature, I mean, it is, it's like a buttery, melty feeling. I personally think they're better coming out of the refrigerator. I like them out of the refrigerator just because they- Makes it take longer. It takes a little bit longer and they do melt pretty quick and so if you're trying to go anywhere with these in your hand they're gonna get you're gonna be especially a mess. if you're like down here in florida yeah. or someplace warm during the summer travel with wet wipes is yeah. my advice <laughs> for that but i mean it's so delicious you don't even care number four how much do they cost okay i'm looking on their website over here we are in our rv if you haven't figured that out yet yeah um so they're 40 dollars a box and what are there 12 in a box i'm assuming Let's, yes 12 12 in a box so Regular price is pretty much all of these bars out there. Yeah. They do have a discount if you buy six boxes, which would have a value of $240, and you would get that for $205. But I would try it first. Make now, sure you like it. Yeah. Now, here's the thing. We are not affiliated with them at all. However, when we reviewed them like two years ago, we did kind of say, like, we will do the review, and we don't want any compensation for the review. Just know that if we don't like it, we're going to bash it. Yeah. And if we do like it, we're going to praise it. But we Be want honest. a coupon code. Yeah. Right? And so that coupon code, he said, is still active. And it is Two Crazy Ketos, and I believe it gets you 10% off. If it's not working, Two Crazy Ketos, if it doesn't work, I'm going to put a link for it or what it is exactly down in the description. If it's not working, go ahead and message them. Say, hey, I saw the review on Two Crazy Ketos. I want to buy this. The coupon code's not working. Because sometimes they don't yeah. work. But he told me it was working at the time when he sent us everything. So if you're interested, that Yeah, if you want to get a money. discount, again, we don't make any money. But we always want to make sure whenever we talk to a company, especially if it's a product we like, that we get some kind of a discount for you guys. Yeah. So number five, would we recommend it? Definitely. I mean, it's no different than it was when we tried the other flavor a couple of years ago now. Mm -hmm really delicious good quality ingredients that's the key for me it's clean ingredients we've gotten to the point now where there's enough products on the market when it comes yeah. to keto you can scrutinize ingredients a little bit more so if you have a company that's just putting loads of stuff maltodextrin and and all of these different fibers and and you know then you have a company like this where okay they're putting in you know a trickery root fiber i'm okay with that but they're not overdoing it. And yeah. so I can scrutinize a little bit more. And I think these are good ingredients. And I knew the owner was actually using them for himself, which is why he well, developed it. It always makes a difference. And when you put keto on something, you know that it's always We're going like, to scrutinize it more. Right. You're always going to look at it a little bit closer than even normal. So I'm I'm really tickled that, that they're still making a really good product. Yep. So, well, that is going to be our video for today. Let us know down in the comment section if you've tried Keto Fit Bars, either this flavor or the old flavor. Mm -hmm. And if you like seeing videos like this, check out some of the other videos that we have linked right down there. Also, make sure you take a look at the most recent video, which I'm gonna put right over here. Whether you head this way or you head this way, don't forget to head this way. Subscribe to our channel and click the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time, bye. bye.